Good morning. Today our book is about da, 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 birds. Lots of different kinds of birds. Do you recognize this bird? I do. I think we've seen this on our playground. It's called a uh, hmm. A robin. You're right. The story is by Jane Werner Watson. And the illustrator, the person that drew the pictures, is Eloise Wilkin. Birds can fly. They fly high. Some fly miles across the sky. You know this kind of bird. I think you do. It's a Canadian goose. You're right. In the spring, birds build nests. Not to rest in, but for their babies. Some birds bring twigs and leaves and bits of string. And some are very neat and they build small, tidy nests. Look at this, what do you notice? Oh, some birds are living in a birdhouse. And other birds are living in their nest in a tree. I wonder if nests are inside the house. That would be interesting to find out. Day and night, mother bird and father bird watch their eggs. They keep them safe and nice and warm. Soon, chip, 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 the eggs start to crack and out slips the baby bird. Look how cute. You're right. One of them is still inside. And this egg just started cracking. The baby birds have no feathers. Look at that. They can't fly yet, but they are very hungry. How do I know that? Look at their mouth. They are wide open. Mommy, feed me. Oh my goodness. They're hungry. What do they eat? Baby birds eat worms and grubs, beetles and bugs, and tiny little insect eggs. Look at that. <gasps> There's a bluebird. They can eat ever so much. Caterpillars, grasshoppers, ants, and flies. Soon the young birds grow feathers. They have lessons to learn, just like you. They have to learn how to listen to their mom and their dad. And they have to learn how to find their food this little red bird and this quail. Look at these little babies. I notice they're very fluffy. I wonder if they'll stay that way. Some take turns at learning how to swim. Do you recognize this bird? I'm sure you do. You're right, one is a mommy and one is a daddy. Very good observation. Most birds also have to learn how to fly. Look at them making a nest. These birds are at the beach. Gulls and terns can see fish through the waves in the water. They swoop down and gooch 
the fish with their mouths and the fishes in their beaks like this. Long-legged birds, like water birds, walk on the beach. They wade in the water. They run along the rocks and they eat tiny little crabs and little insects that they can find. This is called a snipe. Look, there's your sandpiper. Many birds like to eat grains and seeds. Oh, yes, you recognize this. These are chickens. We have chickens at Principia, don't we? Look at that. We have chickens in our yard. They have short, sharp bills for pecking, and they crack the seeds open, or they can swallow them whole. Bobolinks eat most as the summertime ends. Then the black and white and yellow of this happy little singing fellow turns to a dull brown. He changes colors. Look how there's no leaves on this tree. That means it's fall. Summer passes. Weeds and grasses fade and disappear. Cold winds shake the trees and the bushes. Winter time is near. Something tells the birds to fly south for the winter. Larks and warblers, thrushes, thrashes, gray geese following their leaders, off they fly with a honk, 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 or ooh, 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 cry. you notice about this page? Yes, it's snowing. Now the ground is all covered with snow and it's cold. Some birds stay. They may eat at your feeding tray. Bread and suet and seeds are the food a bird needs in the cold. On the snow, you may see a small chickadee hunting seeds. <gasps> Do you see the chickadee? There it is. We have those too. You're right. What other bird do you notice on this page? It's a woodpecker. We have those at our bird feeder too, don't we? The spring will be back. Many birds to sing. They will nest, raise their broods, hunt their foods, sometimes rest the right time for each, they know best. What do you notice about this page? Yeah, flowers on the trees, Moons. You're right, it's spring. What pretty little wood thrushes. That's it. I hope you enjoyed our story. I hope you have a wonderful day. I look forward to hearing what you noticed and what you still wonder about the story that we just read. I'll talk to you soon. I love you.